The OK Corral is classified as a nightclub. The operators say if they wait on the province's schedule to reopen, they won't be around to see it. So they're asking that the authorities give them a chance to become something different in the meantime so they don't have to close down forever. We want customers and customers want us. So it's a you know, two-way street and uh, we do have the, the capabilities here of, of uh, changing stuff around. Um, you know, having uh, the, the uh, six foot uh, perimeter and stuff like that. Uh, we do have a parking lot available to us out on the side uh, that we can extend, extend into so if people want to be outside and away from everybody, fine. But we have a big building here and we have, uh, we have the room uh, to do at least a 50% capacity at this point and, and hopefully back to 100% capacity, but I think that's down the road. So, okay, uh, just walk me through that a little bit. You would extend into the parking lot how would that look well i think it would look good we could we could fence it off it would look just like a bigger patio because our patio is on that side of the parking lot already so we could go out into the parking lot and you know have have 50 people out there or whatever's available you know whatever we can do with the uh, with the room because we can we can uh, run this cabaret like a pub style uh place and we can have food trucks outside so there's food available to everybody um uh, and we have the capability of doing that. We just uh, we just need uh, a little bit of help to push things along so that we can open sooner than later. We can have some bands up on the stage, away from everybody. We can have some live entertainment. We can have uh, a DJ going, uh, you know, every night that we're open. Uh, but we can uh, we can make it work, and uh, people are going to be happy. Obviously, the dancing is going to be uh, be no no for a while. But but who knows? It might get to the point where three or four couples can dance on the dance floor and and. Uh, but if we can get it so that people can come down uh, two or three nights a week or four nights a week, uh, it would be good for the customers and it'd be very good for us to keep the doors open. What we don't want to lose is 35 years of, of a lot of hard work and, and customers that have uh, really, really loved to come to the corral. Just about uh, half of them came every week, either one night or another. How long can, you, can your ownership carrying, uh, carry on um, paying at least a portion of, of the lease with no income? As far as the length of time, uh, probably sooner than later. Not, not long. Yeah, not long. It just would be to that point. We, we just got to get going, and, uh, and I think that we can do it, and I think we can handle it the same way that uh, all of these other bars and pubs have, have done it, and, and I think we can do it, and maybe even a little bit better, and we can keep country music alive.